What's up everyone, this is Wicked and RainHD and tonight I'm going to be showing you how to transform your Galaxy S4 into a Galaxy S6 device. So, I have flashed Albis ROM latest version 3.0 based on 5.0.2 Lollipop which I'm going to be showing you right now. As you may see, 5.0.2 Albi's RAM running hybrid max stock kernel, latest version of course. And why did I flash a a custom kernel? And that's that was because Wi-Fi wasn't working on the first sight. And afterwards everything is working perfectly. Uh, right now let's get into the main features of this ROM. Let's browse through different apps. For example, Dialer. Contacts, messages, it has feature, internet, uh, I'm gonna be showing you guys an S6 feature, for example if you slide from diagonally from, sorry, from here I think I Nope. Jesus. It was working. I think I have to activate and deactivate the multi window. That's a bug. Jesus Christ, what the fuck? It's not working. It was, it was a couple of minutes ago. Oh, right now it's working. Okay, so you can uh, minimize the app, as I told you. It's an uh, S6 feature, but uh, let's get rid of this and let's see the, what why. I think the browser. Yeah, right now finally. I managed to minimize the browser along I have the clock the calculator minimized as you may see you can calculate and browse in the same time of course useless uh, feature from Samsung consumes hell of a lot of run I'm gonna be showing you that oh shit right now let me see um toolbox allows you to take a screenshot to search to maximize and uh, this option lets you for example so you're in your calculator and you slide up and then press the home button and you, it will get here it's in case your button your buttons don't work another features not really ultra poor saving mode Turn on. Turning on onto poor saving mode. As you may see, 10 days. Impressive, really impressive. And force closes. Sorry, that was the. Jesus. Let me mute the sound. Skype. Okay. And we're back. One thing that I found it very stupid from Samsung is that they integrated this kind of live live uh, icon. So it's almost uh, 10 and a half actually yeah 1033 and it updates even the second updates here. So as you may see Who the fuck needs that, by the way? Samsung. Samsung, you just... Yeah. A kernel S tweaks, you can customize your kernel settings. Music. 
Let's see how the music up. Jesus. Strange lag. Okay, let's see how it looks. The lock screen. Yeah. This uh, ROM with this kernel is very sluggish, as you may see. But uh, this is a ROM that you may want to take in consideration if you want a full S6 experience. With all the lags, of course. Because it's <coughs> kind of impossible to run an, X, an uh, S6 ROM on an S4 device. Taking uh, in mind that S6 has a more performant random access memory card, more performant CPU, more performant GPU, and uh, all these ports that's been made are are running pretty well, but not uh, as good as they would run on a Galaxy S6, which seems very logical to me. So my files. Gonna get through all these apps. Of course, briefing here. If you start a business, technology, sports, science. Okay. Yeah. Folders. Camera is stock one from Samsung. From Samsung Galaxy S4. I mean. One thing that is very nice is that the volume button, the volume pop-up is rightly is right where it should be. On a stock lollipop it would be stick to the status bar and it isn't that nice, in my opinion. Settings, everything is working. Lock screen, have here some a ton of unlocking effects <coughs> sorry geometric mosaic yeah all kinds of things voice recorder I think this is also the stock on from Galaxy S6 who the hell uses S voice by the way yeah Hardware buttons have also been changed. Long press on the home button will give you into will get you into the Google now search bar. Single press on the option key will get into a recent task. Yeah. So that was the room guys. That was the overview of Albis 3.0 ROM. I hope you like it. If you did, please thumbs up and subscribe right, right down to my channel. I'll put a link in the description with uh, all these uh, infos and files you'll need in order to get this ROM working as uh, mine in this video. So, thanks for watching guys. Week Android is out. Bye bye.